for real quiet right here now at the Coliseum, but that wasn't the case last night at uh, Trump's rally. Now, the video you're talking about took off overnight, and it took the Cumberland County Sheriff's Office by surprise this morning. Security was extra tight at the Fayetteville Trump rally. About 60 Cumberland County Sheriff's deputies joined Donald Trump's personal security team at the Crown. Just minutes after Trump got on stage, a group with Rakeem Jones started shouting in protest. I stood in the middle finger and all, but what would you do if you were in my situation? You, people yelling at you, and I'm looking down, and I'm seeing people looking at me throwing their middle fingers up too. Jones and his group were the first ones thrown out. What happened next caught him by surprise. So I'm walking, and as I turn, as soon as I turn, he hit me. And I was, like, I thought it was a punch, but as I look at the footage now, it was an elbow, or, like, but he hit me dead in my eye. Authorities have identified the man who threw the punch as 78-year-old John McGraw of Linden. In the video, you can see McGraw going back to his seat while several Cumberland County Sheriff's deputies struggle with Jones. Ronnie Rouse captured video of what appears to be deputies putting Jones on the ground. And they're walking us out, and they got him prone because I thought he was getting arrested. And I was like, I know you are not taking him to jail. Like, he didn't, like, this is impossible. If you look at the video in slow motion, you see Jones turns to say something to McGraw. A deputy tries to restrain him, and they both fall on each other. Sheriff Moose Butler says the video went wild overnight. His department jumped on the investigation this morning. We went to work immediately to identify this man, and we did this morning. We identified him. We made arrangements to pick him up. He's in custody now. And at last check, that's where McGraw is right now, being held at the Cumberland County uh, Detention Center on $2,500 bond. There is another investigation going on right now by the Sheriff's Office, whose butler says that he is checking the video to see if any of the deputies last night actually saw the punch thrown. And if that's the case, that deputy should have charged McGraw last night. David, we reached out to the Trump campaign to get a comment about uh, violence at his rallies. We have yet to hear back from his campaign. David? Gilbert Bay is live in Fayetteville. Gilbert, thank you.